HTTPS is one of the standards of the internet. Uh, HTTPS, and the S stands for SSL, HTTPS is supported by all browsers, Edge, Chrome, Firefox. Uh, if you go to a website which is secured with SSL, HTTPS, automatically uh, the browser changes to HTTPS. And you can see it in the top of your browser, uh, you, before the address, before the domain name, we call this the domain name, you will see HTTPS. So not HTTP, but HTTPS. And you will see a small lock, a symbol of a small lock will be in the top of your browser, sometimes in the bottom of your browser. And almost all websites are nowadays HTTPS. Since Google a couple of years ago said, uh, if you have a website which is HTTP, you can't be found anymore on Google. Uh, so you could say Google enforced all websites to use HTTPS because otherwise you couldn't be found on Google. HTTPS is maybe the most important security mechanism on the internet. HTTPS offers three forms of protection, three forms of security. Uh, the first, uh, the data is encrypted, uh, encrypted over the line. Uh, so nobody can read the data. Uh, if the data is intercepted, uh, if somebody pulls the cable from the ground and it happens, uh, uh, we call that also maybe a man in the middle attack, Hey, so they intercept the data, they can't read it, the data is encrypted. That's the first uh, security mechanism HTTPS offers. But the second, I know for sure that I'm on the correct website. Uh, if I'm on Facebook, facebook.com and it's protected with HTTPS, I know for sure that I'm on the Facebook website. Uh, I'm, I'm going to explain later in detail how this works. And third, and that's forgotten many times, but I also know for sure that the data is unchanged over the line. Uh, meaning, uh, if I create a HTTP request in my browser, I send it to Facebook and nobody can change the data. Uh, the data is always unchanged from my browser until the computer of Facebook. Uh, because maybe the data is encrypted, nobody can read the data, but still they can change the data. Uh, so uh, even if they can't read it, they can add some zeros or one, change the data uh, while it's in transport from my uh, laptop to the computer of Facebook. They change the data. It's not possible with HTTPS. Uh, you right away get an error and uh, an error message saying something is wrong and uh, the data has been changed. So HTTPS offers three forms of security. One, encryption. Uh, nobody can read the data. Second, I know for sure that I'm on the correct website. And three, it's what we call an integrity check. I know for sure the data has not been changed. And I'm going to explain all three mechanisms in detail. And if you want to know more, please visit our website and look for the online training IT Essentials for at Home.